afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Welcome aboard the Wiser Railroad and the Edison locomotive. For the safety of our younger riders, we ask that the adults with them place themselves on the outside of the road. If that's not practical, make sure the kids are held or easily within your reach. Thank you. 729 to 809, high Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Welcome aboard the Wise Railroad and the Edison Locomotive, and welcome to our 67th annual Old Car Festival. You're going to find hundreds of vehicles parked all over the village. Uh, Lots of interesting owners to go along with those interesting automobiles. Make sure you chat with some of them and find out the story of their automobile. This is the dawn of the automobile age that we're celebrating here all the way up to 1930s. We've got some special activities planned throughout the day. Uh, don't miss our Ragtime Street Fair in front of the uh, town hall. We also have a uh, Gaslight Parade tonight. And we're going to close tonight's festivities uh, around 8.50 tonight with fireworks. You're welcome to spend the entire day and entire evening with us here at Greenville Village. On the left, we have the birthplace of Henry Ford, one of the greatest industrial figures of the 20th century. Mr. Ford was born in the upper bedroom of that farmhouse on July 30th, 1863. Just beyond the windmill, Main Street, where we have the Wright Brothers' home and their cycle shop, Mrs. Cohen's millinery store, uh, several other storefronts, and lots of uh, activities to celebrate the old cars. Uh, Ragtime festival just up the street there. Food, beverages, uh, music. Get out there and enjoy the show that we're putting on today. It's really quite spectacular. Thomas Edison's Menlo Park Laboratory, where you kind of a microphone and a phonograph, the electric incandescent light bulb, and hundreds of other patented electric inventions. One of the many interesting spots you can visit while you're here. While you're visiting Menlo Park, uh, don't miss an opportunity to uh, check out Jack Howard's office across the street, where you can uh, learn more about rural 19th century medicine. And next door to the docks office, we have the Logan County, Illinois Courthouse, for a young Abraham Lincoln practice law. All of that and lots of cars to look at while you're down here too. The Ford Model T and the Ford Model A played a great role in the uh, in early automobile history. We have lots of uh, Chevrolets, uh, Cadillacs, Lincoln Motor, which was not part of the Ford Motor Company at the when it was for, and lots of other brands out here as well. Great time to check out the history of the automobile, the birth of the automobile. We're now in our porches and parlors district, a collection of historic American homes and buildings. There's an English Cotswolds cottage out here. We're doing an English tea service throughout the afternoon. Mrs. Fisher's Southern Cooking is open up today till I want to say at least 4 o'clock. Tea service goes till 4 as well. Folks, we'll be stopping shortly at the Susquehanna Station for your safety stay seated that we do. Listen for the whistle. That's the engineer telling us he set the brake and it's safe to move about. Stay seated till you hear the whistle. If you're leaving us, make sure you have all your belongings. Don't forget anything. Remember your wrist and your hand stamp to get you back on the train. We're operating until 9 o'clock tonight, folks. It's now safe to leave the train from the left side of the car. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Welcome aboard the Wiser Railroad and the Edison Locomotive. For the safety of our younger riders, we ask the adults with them place themselves on the outside of the road. If that's not practical, Make sure the kids are held or easily within your reach. Thank you. 729-809, highball. And for the rest of us in our safety, make sure you're always seated while the train is in motion. There's no eating or drinking except for water while on board. Thank you. 
some of the best cars, I think, are out here in the porches and parlors area. We've got Ford Model A's. Uh, looks like uh, a few other uh, brands out there as well. If you get a chance, folks, uh, wind your way back up here. Check out some of the vehicles parked. Oh, from the station here all the way down to the farmhouse. I think, like I said, some of the best ones are out here. Farmhouse at the end of the lane, the Daggett Farmhouse, built in 1754 in West Hanover, Connecticut. It predates the American Revolution. Stop back. Uh, the ladies inside love company. They'll show you around, talk about the chores they're doing. They might even take you for a walk in that uh, raised garden behind the house there. A little produce and lots of herbs and flowers. Swanee Lagoon and National Catch. 
splash basin for flood water and rainwater runoff here at the village. If you look at the trees on the left, you can see the steeple of the Martha Mary Chapel, a non-denominational church site of any weddings here at the village, spring, summer, and fall. Just across the road from the chapel, the Taste of History Restaurant and the Eagle Tavern, both premier restaurants here at the village, and both open until we, uh, throughout the uh, afternoon and evening. And folks, we are open until 9 p.m. tonight. We're now entering the railroad junction district and we'll soon be stopping at Smith Street Depot, ideally located here. Liberty Craft Works, the carousel and Main Street activities, your short walk to the Roundhouse, the Depot. The two restaurants I just mentioned, uh, everything's very convenient to this station here. If anyone needs directions or has a question, feel free to stop me on the platform and happy to help you. In the meantime, if you are leaving us here, make sure you have all your belongings so you don't forget anything. Remember your wristband, your hand stamp, we'll get you back on board the train up to about 9 o'clock tonight. Listen for the whistle, everyone. That's the engineer telling us to set the brake and it's safe to move about. Stay seated till you hear the whistle. safety, make sure you're always seated while the train is in motion. There's no eating or drinking allowed except for water while on board. Thank you. I'd like to welcome everybody to the 67th Annual Old Car Festival. Uh, quite a show today and uh, I'll continue through tomorrow. Folks, don't forget, uh, we're open until 9 o'clock tonight. No need to rush uh, through. Uh, we're not closing at 5 as usual. We're open until 9 o'clock tonight. We're closing the activities. There's plenty of them with fireworks tonight at about 8.50. I do believe the slow speed that we're uh, leaving the station, we're going to be stopping for water up here at the water tower. Could be wrong. They usually give me an alert, but uh, that would be my guess. We've got a car here on the right have been repainted and re-stenciled with the names of historic American railroads. Coming up on the left, our water tower and coaling tower. Well, I guess we're not stopping. Brick building up ahead, the roundhouse where we take our steam locomotives to service, repair, and maintenance. They're doing turntable demonstrations at the roundhouse today. I believe one is in progress right now. You too can uh, test your strength and your will by turning that 42 ton turntable out the front. Don't worry, I can do it, so I'm sure everybody else can do it. We're now passing a bag of Liberty Craftworks for our master craftsmen are working in the pottery, glass, tin, wool carding, weaving, and print shops, trades that propelled America into the Industrial Revolution. Stay seated. We come to the point stop. The platform here is on the right. You 
that's just from the right side of the ground. Listen for the whistle. That's the engineer telling us that he set the brake, and it's safe to move about. Stay seated till you hear that 